You said you were too nervous to ask your healthcare provider about well, I'm not. Come with me to New York and let's ask the pros. We're here with Dr. Jason Baker. Hey. So we have a burning question for you. What is the average life expectancy for someone with type 1 diabetes in today's day? Kind of a loaded question in a way, but here's my simple answer. If you're living in a place with all the resources you need to manage diabetes well, your life expectancy actually could go up. Because think about it, you're more aware of your health. Yeah. You're taking care of yourself better. You're using the resources that you have. But I would say it depends on where you're diagnosed. I work in many parts of the world that don't have access to a lot of the things that we have. Unfortunately, there is a life expectancy that's dramatically cut low. It really depends on if you're living somewhere with access to resources, insulin, ways of testing your blood sugar. Yeah. The challenge of diabetes, I think, makes us strong. We need more doctors like Dr. Baker. Uh, <laughs> what are you too nervous to ask your doctor? 